So if you're going to Biloxi and you want to get around, I got a great idea for you. So I did my homework and I found out that the Coastal Transit Authority, they call it CTA, has a bus system to where you can get around Biloxi and Gulfport pretty simply. So one of the things I did before we went on the trip is I downloaded their app. It's called Route Shout 2.0. So you can go ahead and you can put in all your favorite spots, your favorite bus routes. And of course, at the time, I didn't know what my favorite bus routes were because I had never done it before. But when you get there, they have these pamphlets everywhere, even at the bus stops and the transit authority. So one of the routes, of course, that we wanted to take since we were staying at the Beau Rivage is called the Casino Hopper, which is Route 2. So basically, it's this simple. You go on your app and you, and you press your favorite spots. And I would put in Beau Rivage slash Hard Rock as a right next door. They share a bus stop. And it would tell me exactly how long till my bus gets there. And then it would tell me the next one and so forth. So if it said three minutes, sure enough, the bus was on time every time. And with this pamphlet, it tells you the different routes and has all the different times on it that you need to be there at the bus stop. Okay, so that came in pretty handy that over here. The second thing they have is an attraction guide. The attraction guide shows you all the different attractions they have in Biloxi and it's color coded by route numbers, meaning which routes you want to be on. Okay, you can see you got your Boomtown and all the other things if you want to go to the mall and so forth. So one of the things we wanted to do is we wanted to try out Gulfport. And it turned out to be quite simple. You get on the, you go to the main transit center, which you can get on from the casino hopper. Then you, we got onto what was called the beachcomber. And it says there's a beachcomber east and west. It really doesn't matter because they go both ways. Then we took that and we went, we stopped at Treasure Bay Casino. Um, I think that was the only stop. Then it took us to the transit center there, and then we got on to another bus, which was called the Red Line, which is a red line and a blue line. Again, doesn't matter. They, they just all go into a circle. And we took that, and we ended up at Island View Casino. And of course there, I, I made Island View my favorite spot. So when we were thinking about leaving, we typed, we just pressed the button for Island View, and it told, us, told me when the buses were coming. So we had one leaving in six minutes and one leaving in like 45 minutes. So we decided to stay and have lunch, which was a great idea because we enjoyed it. Anyway, so we caught the bus and it was really easy coming back and the bus driver even dropped us off at the lighthouse. So we could go ahead and view that and take some pictures and videos of that to share with you. And it was a lot of fun. And again, so easy. So if you're going to Biloxi, make sure you download, excuse me, download Route Shout 2.0, it makes everything really simple and easy. So if you get on the bus, every time you get on the bus, it's $1.50. There are certain spots on the route that are called a, a fair spot, and which means you have to put in $1.50 again. So if you don't, and it's cash only, keep in mind, cash only, they do not take cards. But we found since we were there for three days, we got a three day pass, which is $14 per ticket. If you just do a day pass, it's $6 per person. So again, we did the three day pass, $14 each, saved a lot of money. We got to see all of Biloxi and Gulfport and it was worth it. So don't forget, Route Shout 2.0.
this is the bus station that goes to everything around here so it's pretty close to the hotel so we just walked here and we are uh, gonna get on a bus to go to I think it's called Treasure Bay so it's a little further away and see what other sites we see so join us for more so I'll show you the bus station before I get out the Greyhound stations also here So this is what it looks like. And it was only a five minute walk from Waffle House. And as you can see in the distance right there is our hotel. I wanted to call Saving Tip while you're in Biloxi. It's the Coast Transit Authority. And that is the little trolley slash bus system. And they have um, little things with all the different attractions you can go to. And they also have a a list of all the different bus routes, where they go, and the times they leave and depart. Um, for two days, we've been on the casino hopper, which basically goes in a big square to take you to, of course, all the casinos. It's been very convenient, and today we're going to try to venture out and take a different bus route and get off this part of Biloxi and check out some other sites. So we'll see you there. Keep in mind, you can get a three-day pass for $14 each. It'll save you a lot of money. Uh, a lot of the buses are here now. We're going to be getting on this one right here. This beachcomber is Route 1 and it goes to the um, Gulf, Gulfport Casinos.